Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. In today's video, we will be discussing drug dosing based on body surface area. Before entering into the session, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Let's get into the topic. Body surface area. Body surface area generally measures the total surface area of a person's body. It is expressed in meter square. Body surface area is crucial in pediatrics for accurate medication dosing, providing a better assessment of a child's metabolic mass than body weight alone. This is especially important for medications with narrow therapeutic indices and treatments like chemotherapy, where precise dosing is vital for efficacy and safety. Next is formula. The most popular formula to calculate body surface area is body surface area in meter square is equal to square root of weight in kilogram multiplied by height in centimeter divided by 3600. Let's begin the calculation with an example. A four-year-old child, height 97 centimeter and weight 17 kilogram, requires a medication dosage of 2 milligram per meter square. The medication is available in a vial with a concentration of 1 milligram per ml. How many milliliters should be administered to this child for each dose? Here, the desired dose is 2 mg per meter square. Drug concentration is 1 mg per ml. Height is 97 cm. Weight is 17 kg. The formula to calculate body surface area is square root of weight in kilogram multiplied by height in centimeter divided by 3600, which is equal to square root of 17 multiplied by 97 divided by 3600 which gives the answer 0 0.67 the next step will be calculating the total dose based on the body surface area obtained and the formula is total dose is equal to 2 milligram multiplied by body surface area that is 2 multiplied by 0 0.67 which gives 1.35 milligram the final step is the volume to administer will be calculated so the formula will be total dose in milligram divided by drug concentration in milligram per ml which is equal to 1.35 divided by 1 which gives the answer 1.35 ml so the nurse should administer 1.35 ml of the medication to the child for each dose. Let's do another example. A 4-year-old child height 80 cm, weight 15 kg, requires a medication dosage of 3 mg per meter squared. The medication is available in a vial with a concentration of 2 mg per ml. How many milliliters should be administered? To this child for each dose so the desired dose here is 3 milligram per meter squared drug concentration is 2 milligram per ml height is 80 centimeter and weight is 15 kilogram the body surface area calculation will be bsa in meter squared is equal to square root of weight in kilogram multiplied by height in centimeter divided by 3600 which is equal to square root of 15 multiplied by 80 divided by 3600 which gives the answer 0 0.57 meter squared next we calculate the total dose based on body surface area total dose is equal to 3 milligram multiplied by 0 0.57 meter squared which gives the answer 1.73 milligram. Now the final step is calculating volume to be administered. So volume to be administered in ml is equal to 
total dose in milligram divided by drug concentration in milligram per ml which is equal to 1.73 milligram divided by 2 milligram per ml which gives the answer 0.86 ml so the nurse should administer 0.86 ml of the medication to the child for each dose now few examples for your practice a 5 year old child height 100 cm weight 21 kg requires a medication dosage of 1.5 mg per meter squared the medication is available in a vial with a concentration of 2 mg per ml how many ml should be administered to this child for each dose next example is a 4 year old child height is 90 cm weight 19 kg requires a medication dosage of 2 mg per meter squared the medication is available in a vial with a concentration of 2.5 mg per ml how many milliliters should be administered to this child for each dose you can do the calculation and mention the answers on the comment box so here you go with drug dosing based on body surface area if you find this video useful please like it share it and subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications thanks for watching and have a nice day